Hi guys and welcome to All of the Secrets. Today we are going to be creating a brand new YouTube channel and I'm really excited to sort of share this journey with you. So my hopes and dreams for this channel is I want to sort of start from the very start with zero subscribers and I want to show you the tips and tricks that you can do with your channel that is going to help you bring in the subscribers, bring in the views. I'm going to share all of my tips and tricks that I have found that can help build YouTube channels and I want to sort of show that from a scale where there's, it starts from nothing and I want to show you like it actually works. I thought the best way to do that is literally film everything, put it on YouTube and then it's up to you to sort of see what can work for your channel. I'm going to be showing you the analytics, the programs that I use that are going to help sort of boost my YouTube channel and basically try out all the tips and tricks that YouTubers share that can help you sort of build your channel but I'm starting from scratch so I feel like hopefully it'll be a little bit more relatable to you guys because it's it's all well and good like somebody with a million subscribers telling you what you should and shouldn't do for your YouTube channel but if you don't have that following I think it's quite difficult to sort of find your way around YouTube and sort of get started so I'm hoping that within doing this it can sort of help you understand maybe what things can work for a smaller youtube channel and come along on this journey with me so that you can see like what might work for you within saying that if it's something that you are interested in learning seeing if it works then do remember to hit the subscribe button down below so that we can do this together and learn from each other and just help each other out so subscribe Give this video a thumbs up if it's something that you're excited to see the progress with because I know I am and leave me a comment as well with some of your YouTube channels and stuff like that and we can sort of check each other out and just sort of help each other out as well. So yes, let's get this first YouTube video filmed. I have my laptop here and we are going to actually see how we actually do this. A little bit of background about me, the reason why I sort of feel like I know what I'm talking about with YouTube and why I have confidence that I can do this is because I do already have a YouTube channel but it's not like a massive YouTube channel at all. It's got 6,000 subscribers on there and it's not really the same sort of channel that I'm doing here. So this one's more about like growth and stuff like that. Whereas that one is just a little bit of my life, a little bit all over the place. So I have recently found some ways to sort of help that grow. And I'm hoping to put that onto this one and sort of see if them same things work for this one. But I don't feel like I have the sort of audience where I'll come from one YouTube channel to another. So that's why I feel confident in the fact that this is literally starting from scratch. The first thing that you do need to do, which I have already done, is you're going to need to set up a Gmail account, basically like a Google account. And this is going to help you sort of like start up your YouTube channel. So you go onto YouTube and then you can see your little profile up there. You're going to want to log into the new Gmail that you're going to want to use for your YouTube account. Right, so there you can see it says create a channel. So. Your creator journey begins pursuing your creative passions. Get started. So the first step that you're gonna wanna pick is choose how to create your channel. So if you are just wanting to use your name and stuff like that, you just wanna click on the use your name part. But if you want to use something a little bit different, like what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna click on the other one. And we are then gonna put in the channel name that you want to sort of pick why am i not spelling this right and then create that's all gone through there and it says nice work your channel all the secrets has been created so the first thing that you definitely want to do is you want to sort of like that was actually really easy nothing really had to be done quite there but you do want to make sure that you're doing all of this bit here which is like uploading a picture tell viewers about your channel so that's just like the about bit you can then add in some of your links and stuff like that so I'm going to quickly go ahead and just sort of fill all of that in as well make sure you've got like a really good quality photo for your thumbnail and stuff like that and it's quite difficult because I do feel like you should have the thumbnail is something that you are definitely going to want to be talking about in your YouTube videos because that can help people click as well because if you've got a picture of a dog or something like that and you're talking about cats, then people aren't really going to click on that. You know what I'm saying? But obviously, if you're just talking about vlogs, 
stuff like that than just a simple picture of yourself or something like that if you are um family vlog or something like that then you can maybe include your family or even sometimes people just use like the name of their brand in the thumbnail as well so just make something that's quite like eye-catching or something like that i find something nice and bright and something easy to actually look at you can obviously go back into everything and change it if you really need to but there's just an idea as to what i'm writing in the description so we are just saving and continuing there we have it um so it's very basic obviously there's no videos or anything on there right now but one thing that i would suggest to do is maybe have a look at all of the customizable bits really make it your own like take this time to sort of really look at the back end of youtube so if it's not something that you've ever looked at before you can definitely click on the learn more and it'll go through like tutorials step by step as to what it is that needs to be done you can add in channel trailers normally i like to just put one of my videos so pro i'll probably end up putting this video on because it's like the main intro to the channel so that's a good idea to have like a good intro as to like what it is your, your channel's about have that as your trailer featured video for returning subscribers i like to put like the most popular video in there because there's a reason why it's the most popular and then you have featured selections for your uploads and stuff like that that'll just tell you like which position you want your certain videos do you want them ordered by popularity or do you want them ordered by recently uploaded stuff like that and then you have all of these other what's branding yeah so you have all of these other customization bits so you do want to add in a banner which i think i have already done it's quite tricky to actually make the banners it's really weird because you've got to put make this big massive sort of like picture and then have the text like in the middle because just the way that it needs to be viewable on the tv the desktop and the devices so if it's something that you just want me to sort of go into a little bit more how to create all of this bit then i can do that let me know in the comments but i'm just going to upload mine there and then i do need to upload an image for watermark but i don't think i have anything to be honest mm, let me see if i can do something with this one maybe i need to change i need to have a look at that and make sure it's something that i do want to have but you get the idea as to what i'm doing there so you do want to make sure all of this is done i think for when you do create your youtube channel just so that it's all done and it looks very professional that's the reason behind me doing this right now it's just so it looks a little bit more profesh so you can then click on your face and it'll take you back to your channel for you to have a look and see the things that you've changed so i love that i think that just looks so cute it makes me so excited you've got your tags here i'm pretty sure you can rearrange them because i don't really use facebook so i want instagram to be like be the first one that people click on rather than facebook because like i say i don't really use it so here you go you can just change mm, definitely don't use twitter you can just change out what people click on and stuff like that you can add stuff in if you have more of like a, a google web page or something like that so you have links on banner so i'm just going to put the first one to be honest because i don't really use any of the others contact information if you want to put in your contact information which i think is always a good idea because then if people are trying to contact you for like brand deals and stuff like that then i think it's important to have that information there straight away monetization so as you can see from channel monetization you're not eligible quite yet because you need the thousand subscribers and you need to have four thousand watch hours so i'm going to share some tips and tricks in in the next upcoming videos on the things that i know that can help you get that quicker so subscribe if you are wanting to know that as well settings for me obviously this needs changed because i'm in england so personally i don't really know if any of this bit is important like adding in all of like your information but it could be and i think it's important to sort of add that in because sometimes it might help sort of like share the videos is into the particular area which it benefits most with so for me i'm going to be talking more about like british pounds and stuff like that and somebody with euros might not want to hear that or some people with um dollars might not want to hear that so it might distribute them in the countries that need to hear the most and something else you read this is super important this is something that you really need to sort of like look into when you're starting your youtube channel and that is keywords so in a future video uh the software that i use to help with my youtube channel and it is a 
place called TubeBuddy. I need to talk more about that in a future video and how I use TubeBuddy to sort of help grow success on my old channel but obviously I want to take that into the new channel and tell you if it works with zero subscribers. So what, what TubeBuddy does it just sort of helps sort of give you the keywords that benefits your channel the most and it just helps you sort of get your channel out to the people who will actually click on it rather than it being hidden down the bottom where you think well this is a good keyword but for your channel it's not the best if that makes sense so using TubeBuddy it really helps sort of give you the correct information for your channel so there is links down below if you want to sort of head to TubeBuddy and you like see what their website's about so I do leave that down below but I'll not be talking in depth about it in this video but within the next few the, I will do a dedicated video on TubeBuddy and if it works for zero subscribers but like I say you definitely do want to add in some keywords and a keyword is just basically words that describe your channel that people are going to search and it will bring up your channel so as you can see that is some of the keywords that I'm using for my channel so that's all a bit for basic info advanced settings for me personally as I am not making my channel for kids I need to put um no another suggestion is you want to link your google ads account straight away I know you're not going to get google ads quite yet but at least it's done and they can review it and they can sort of authorize it you then have all of this information which to make life easier it might be worth you sort of like setting up so at the bottom this is all of the stuff that will get included in your video every single time so for me personally i want all the secrets in there every time time and for visibility i don't mm, i probably shouldn't have it on anything i should have left that but I want my name in there I want the visibility private because I don't want it to go public straight away and then I might add in a description I need to go back in there and sort of see what it is that I need to write in there and that's probably going to be when I upload my first video to understand what exactly I'm going to write in my description Um, advanced settings I guess my video language could be English United Kingdom this isn't stuff that you need to do but it could help and why not do it once than having to do it all the time you want to put in your sort of like category so people in blogs and then just remember to hit the save but if I am right in seeing this that should be everything that needs to be done really within the creating the YouTube channel there's not nothing really much so you want to make sure that you'll make it look professional straight away so that people look come and look to your channel and sort of think oh wow this person knows what they're talking about you know what I mean you want a good profile picture you want a good banner and make sure that banner can be viewed on all options make sure you do them two things add in your social links and also the tags the keywords of your channel make sure you do them as well to make sure that um straight away people are getting notified of your channel that need to be that is it for creating my YouTube channel I'm nervous I'm excited and I'm excited to have some of you join me on this journey so please hit the subscribe button if you are excited to potentially learn something within growing a brand new YouTube channel and yeah let's do this subscribe leave me a comment because I'd love to reply to some of you and give it a thumbs up if you're excited as excited as me and I'll see you in the next one bye guys <laughs>